third and 19. Antonio Brown was inactive last week against Atlanta. So this is his first NFL regular season game. He's got room for Ronis to beat it. There he goes. He'll be chased and he is gone. 97 yards. Oh, what a way to start. Welcome to Pittsburgh. The Steelers about to play host to the New England Patriots. Third and four, a Roethlisberger. Just might be the best receiver he has ever played with. I just can't say enough good things about Antonio Brown. He was second in yards, second in receiving, I think, a season ago. Two time MVP out of the last. Are you as fast as he is? Yeah, and I'm still available for pump attack. <laughs> Antonio Brown trying to get to the outside. The plays that he makes are very big. He's explosive. There's nothing he can't do in field. Brown gets by Uber down the sideline. He goes for the touchdown. your resume and the thing that I see that distinguishes you from the other guys is where they're all 6'2 superhuman figures. Brown down the sideline back to the middle of the field and now he might go. Brown. His ability to create yards after catch and finally started to get the credit he rightfully deserves. Six round draft pick. Self made guy. Works harder than anybody else in the league. This guy, arguably the best receiver in that event, needs no introduction. Antonio Brown. I love the fact that he's making me proud of him wearing that number. What Antonio Brown brings to the table is the ability to orchestrate his magic in the confines of an outstanding system. He's the bell count. He gets in and out his touch so fast. He can't do nothing but respect him. Somebody like myself and others, I look at you because of what you do with punt returns, not just as a wide receiver. I consider you the best in the game. I've always been a fan of the short guys that have to go through something to get where they're at. He's the best player on the field. No matter who we play, he's the best player on the field. Caught the ball over the middle, and then did a front flip in the end zone. 